Hello and welcome to Always a Friday. Hello and welcome to Always a Friday and today we are in Tokyo exploring Shinjuku. There's so much to see here. We're going to have a stroll around having a look at all the skyscrapers. We're going to see the world's busiest train station which is Shinjuku station. We might even try some baseball and have a go in the batting cages. At the moment we're at Shinjuku Gyoen which is one of the biggest parks in Tokyo. So let's go and have a look. So we come in through Aikido Gate and the first thing we've seen is this greenhouse which looks magnificent so let's go have a look inside. Wow. So we're inside the greenhouse now and it's so cool to walk around, really interesting. So that was the greenhouse and it was really cool having a little wander around and looking at all the plants but now we're outside and in Shinjuku Gyoen there's three different gardens. There's a French garden, an English garden and a Japanese garden which is where we're at now so let's go and have a look. We are in the English landscape garden at the moment and it's awesome. It kind of reminds us back of home, living in the UK, um, which is quite a strange feeling considering we're in central Tokyo. And now let's go and find the French garden. So we made it to the French gardens and just look how beautiful it is. I could spend all day here and considering it's only 200 yen to get in, it's amazing. And so crazy that something this beautiful and quiet is right next to one of the busiest districts in Tokyo. It's really insane. Um, so we're gonna leave it there now and we're gonna go and explore some more of Shinjuku. So let's go. Shinjuku is one of the busiest districts in all of Tokyo. It's full of busy roads, there's loads of shops, tons of really good restaurants as well. You certainly won't go amiss finding something to do in this modern metropolis. Just watch out for Godzilla, who's perched on top of the Toho Cinema building. Shinjuku is also home to Kabukicho, which is Tokyo's largest and wildest red light district. It's quiet during the day, but this place certainly comes to life at night. After wandering around the entertainment district in Shinjuku, it's finally time to go and play some baseball at the batting cages. So let's go and wish us luck. So we just got to Shinjuku Batting Center and these places are quite popular in Japan and Tokyo. Basically where you can come and play baseball for a little bit. It's an automated machine that throws balls at you and you basically get the bat and try and hit it. So we're going to give it a go. Um, it's 300 yen for each go and they have different speeds. This one is 90 kilometers. It goes from 130 I think down to about 80 kilometers an hour. So we just kind of pick somewhere in the middle. So let's give it a go. That 
towards the batting cages is so much fun and it is actually really good exercise. Plus it's only 300 yen each, so really affordable. Um, and you get loads of balls as well. So we've had the most amazing day in Shinjuku, but it's not over yet. So we're gonna go and see the world's busiest train station. <laughs> Let's go. So we just made it to Shinjuku station and this place is absolutely massive. And now three and a half million people pass through the station each and every day, which is crazy, making it by far the world's busiest. It's got 20 different tracks and 12 different train lines all running through it. So we're gonna take you now all the way through our journey from here all the way through to our train. So let's go. Shinjuku as much as we did and um, so if you like the video give us a thumbs up leave a comment below and subscribe if you haven't already and um, we'll see you next time